Howdy everyone and welcome to today's video. We're with the FASH 155 today on uh, Prokhorovka. It is my favorite map when there is no artillery, but uh, this game we've got two artillery, so... Yeah, two artillery on, on their side, we've got three on our side. Uh, it's encounter game, I'm gonna start by going towards the 1-2 line. This game was... Uh, I was playing this tank for the road to the three gun marks on this tank. You all know how the fast from 55 is, it's literally the worst tier 10 to the super unreliable. Gun is bad, the reload time is bad. I don't need to, to, to keep talking further on how bad this tank is. I think we can all agree that this tank is just bad. Okay, since their scout died early in the game, I wanna I wanna make it up to E1 because I'm not sure our our scout is gonna go there. I got a little bit of V-Range with the rations and optics and the V-Range skills, so I want to go to E1, maybe, maybe try to get some spots in the forest. Because I don't have any damage at this point and I, uh, yeah, I needed it for the 3 gun mark. There's a 430 there, let's see if I can pop him. Ah, uh, just got a D-Track. Can I get second shot though? That outloader sound is so weird, isn't it? Wee -wee -wee -wee. Uh, none of the shot on the grill, come on, can I get it? I'm all, I have no idea. Let's hope I did. In any case, I'm gonna go pop in the bush. They don't really have anything close, hopefully. So maybe I'll be able to spot a little bit of something. Yeah. Pretty weird, though. Not a lot of people in the forest on, the, on, on, on this map. <laughs> Super weird. Usually it's full of, of people. All I gotta do is wait. If something pops in, I'm gonna spot it. I think. So... But since the 430 died, I don't think they're going to be too brave. So I'm going to have to wait for the scout to go in and just support him. Well, if there's nobody in the forest that only uses us with one uh, place. They're, everybody's in the, is on the hill. Because they're not really getting spotted in the middle. Besides that KV4, so everybody must be on the hill. Yeah. I'm loaded now. The, the scout is going in, so I'm gonna get ready to... Uh, well, I wanted to go back to double bush in case he spots, but there's a grill spotted in the back and I don't see it. Yeah, I need to uh, I need to move forward, but I don't know if they still have anything. Okay, get this KV-4. Yeah, I got the kill on the KV-4. Yeah, it's time to move, because... Um, I really don't see any targets. I think they're all busy shooting that grill there. Well, I'm wasting time, so... Hmm. I, I I just didn't know what, what else is in the forest. That's why I was reluctant to go in. Otherwise, I would have just went in, no problem. But the one to one is spotting. Let's see if we can get a little bit of something. <clears throat> My one to one. Give me something. There's the right metal. Uh... Gun handling is so bad in this thing, but I still managed to snap the, the right metal. The grill? Nah. Well, it's 7-1, and I don't think I got like more than 1k damage at this point, so there's only one thing for me to do if I want to save this game and get the gun racks. I need to yield the hill and uh, get the spots no matter what. On a side note, don't those those dual... Isn't that dual exhaust and the flash like super good looking? Damn. <laughs> I need to yellow the hill ASAP and get the spots even if I die. Because uh, you know how hard I tried to, 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 to get the gun marks on this tank. I can safely say now that this was probably the worst gun mark grind ever. Because it was really the worst. <laughs> Not even the lower mark didn't feel so bad. So, yeah. Problem is this uh, the scout is gonna go in front and take my spotting, so I gotta pop up there and uh, at least share the, the assist damage with them. Even if I'm gonna get shot, it doesn't matter. He has a nice E4 there, I can get some nice damage. Ah, uh, shell went into the Fosh instead. I'm just gonna go for the easy damage here. Do wanna bounce on the Fosh, because I really need it. I'm spotting. If I can pop one more shell into this guy, that'd be nice. There I go. I'm just gonna stay up and peek back and forth to get that assist damage, so shoot him up, boys. Shoot him up, because the, the hunting season is open. At E4, shoot me with that explosive. <laughs> hunting season is open, boys. Come on. Would seem 
w would seem quite weird to get the gun racks with this kind of game, right? Yeah. Indeed. Oh man, I still want to kill that E4. <laughs> but I'm reloading. Hey, this is the biggest problem of the fast round 5 5. 45 seconds reload time. It's super un it's unreal. There we go, you died. That was actually enough to get a three gun marks on this <laughs> piece of shit tank. Wow. We got a three gun marks, 44k credits, 1230 XP. Not a very exciting game, but hey, got, got the job done. We ended up with 3761 damage, three kills, 820 base XP. We got 2111. This is damage. See, this is where my view range came, came in handy. And we have a main 9k profit in the end. This might be the worst tier 10 tank this world, but damn, those gun marks look sexy on this tank, don't they? Yeah, I wish the thing would just be better considering how good it looks. <laughs> Any case, boys, um, yeah, thank you all for watching. Hopefully, you enjoyed the not so exciting Fast Rock 5 game. Too bad I didn't get the third mark with a more with a, with a better game, but hey, I'm happy that I got it. If you did uh, enjoy the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Until then, don't forget, stay already safe. Goodbye.